Are you a Green Bay Packers fan? If yes you are in the right channel before watching the video I ask you to please subscribe to the channel and like the video thank you Green Bay Packers activate rookie draft pick from NFI list. The Green Bay Packers had a very eventful offseason. Between the Aaron Rodgers trade to the NFL draft, the roster is vastly different than just a year ago. The Packers added lots of young pieces in the draft and just activated Grant Dubose from the non-football injury, NFI, list. What does the Green Bay Packers activating Dubose mean? Dubose has missed all of the off-season program and training camp with a back injury. He was the 256th pick for the Green Bay Packers in the NFL draft. He will now be able to showcase his talents as he enters a competition for a spot on the roster. Malik Heath, Bo Melton, Dontavian Wicks and Grant Dubose will all be grinding to earn a spot on the roster. Dubose was a human highlight reel at Charlotte and is fourth on the school's all-time receiving list, and he only played two full seasons. Dubose is 6 foot 2, 201 pounds, and ran a 4.57 second 40-yard dash. Dubose has fantastic hands and a knack for making ridiculous catches. As of now, he is a little bit behind the curve since he is just now seeing the field. Undrafted rookie Malik Heath and 2022 seventh round pick Bo Melton are ahead of him in the competition for the last few receiver spots on the 53-man roster. Matt LaFleur acknowledged the importance of getting on the field for Dubose earlier in the offseason. Think any time guys, especially young players, aren't getting the reps, there's always a concern there. At some point, we anticipate him being back. Matt LaFleur on Grant Dubose missing time. Matt LaFleur's anticipation can finally come to an end with Dubose officially returning to practice. Please the like on the video and subscribe to the channel I update you with the news in the next video bye.